For those of you curious about the setup process for Roland Rambles, uh, I made a video mostly talking about the safety of driving earlier, but here's a real quick overview. Hopefully you can see it. It's getting a little dark. This is the Panasonic GH5S with a Panasonic 9mm f1.7 lens. I picked this lens because it is an ultra-wide lens, but it is not as wide as my 7.5mm. Um, the 7.5 is very, very wide, but the problem with it, especially given how dark it is where I'm sitting anyway to do this setup, um, the problem with it is that it's 3.5, not 1.7, so the aperture is like two and a half, two and two thirds stops or whatever. Um, it's way darker. Um, even with a GH5S, a beast of a camera in low light, it's the, the aperture's too, it's just, it's just not open enough. So I use this Panasonic 9mm. It's an expensive lens, but it's fantastic for what I'm doing. Um, but you don't have to have such a wide lens. The, the advantage of an ultra wide lens is that the shake that will happen, there are reasons for this. It absolutely will happen. An ultra-wide lens doesn't show the shake is bad. I have this Delkin Devices uh, Fat Gecko mount. It's a triple mount. They sell single, double, and triple. I have the equivalent to the single that I actually bought at Best Buy like eight years ago. This is uh, just a single suction cup arm here holding up my Ceramonic SRWM2100 receiver. Uh, micro wireless microphone receiver jacked into the microphone jack. And then I have a Ceramonic microphone here, which is going to be clipped onto my belt here. If you look here, I do a, a chin test. See, I, I lean my big fat stupid chin over and does my does my chin hit the microphone if I lean forward? Because driving, this will happen, and it is hitting the microphone, but I'm also leaning very far forward. The mic is going to pull during driving. Now, <clears throat> because I have run out of battery before, it's been an issue, I also have my Android phone with Hillary Swank, absolutely necessary. Um, I have my Android phone, which I'm pulling from the charger, because the charger could induce noise in the line. And I have this $8 eBay lapel mic here. It's a lavalier, it's just, it, it's just an eBay mic. It's nothing special. And I use an app that unfortunately has ads called Easy Voice Recorder for Android. Um, I'm not paying for it, stop asking. I take this microphone and I pull the other microphone back off slide this one up into it so that it's kind of bouncing around in there. Let me see if I can show it to you. Okay. So I have here on my safety belt, I have both my good Ceramonic wireless lavalier and then I have the eBay cheapo $8 microphone which runs to my cell phone and I start recording. I can go ahead and start recording any time because we're going to do a sync clap later. Um, I'm not going to go over the settings, but basically 48 kilohertz, um, wave, uncompressed audio, and I think I use the microphone with processing on because without processing it's a problem. Notice it peaks a lot. I I've got no solution for that. I may move the mic away to solve that, actually. I may move it down a bit more. Um, that mic is a backup because uh, the batteries do run out on these sometimes. Now, <clears throat> on the camera, I have these gloves up here, by the way. They're sealing up the space between the camera and the windshield here. Uh, it kind of pads the camera so it doesn't shake as much, but it will still shake. Now, you can see me holding this camera up. Um, on my GH5S, the main thing is manual focus, manual everything, except I've got ISO set to auto. I've got shutter speed of a 1 one hundredth of a second to take some of the uh, blur out from moving, but I've maximized the aperture so that you can see me. Look at that color temperature difference. Anyway, uh, manual focus, and the crucial thing is in manual focus mode, you want to focus on the eyes. So what we do is we lean back. You can see this camera. We lean back to about where our head will be when driving, and we focus 
until the eyes are in focus as much as possible. That's about it. Tap this to get it back. Okay, we're in focus. Um, the light looks good. I've got the exposure down two notches because the light outside will cause things to overexpose in here often. Um, so I've got my mic. I'm going to turn it on now. This is just the receiver base. And then I'm going to turn on my actual wireless lav here. Okay. And you can see the lights on the two lavaliers are flashing. They're talking to each other. But most importantly, most importantly by far, you can see the bouncing meters. Now the meters are getting too high. I've got it set to auto limit because it's handy. But these mics are always too hot right out of the gate. So I turned the volume down on both. Um, this one is high. That one is high. That's looking better. That's looking a lot better. Um, you see how it's not getting up as high? We can always make it louder, but we can never take clipping out. So we want to make sure that the clipping is not a problem. And now what I'm going to do, other than freak out the neighbors, um, now what I'm going to do is hit record. Okay. And then we will sync clap. And then the sync clap, you'll see the sync clap is there and we can match that up in editing if we need to. All right, that's about it for me. It looks like this thing's battery's running out anyway. Take it easy.